which one? Woo! What do you think it is, Gray? Yeah. <laughs> I know it does for me. It's super sharp. Welcome back guys. We are super excited. We have a really cool episode for you today. We're gonna do a little bit of what we used to do and we're gonna build a new aquarium. But you know house buildings. We can't do just the normal aquarium. So what we're going to do, I don't know if you notice, if you don't know what this is, this is a blowgun. We are going to have Grayson here. Gray, you ready? You ready to use your blowgun? Yeah. We're gonna have Grayson here use the blowgun and shoot at these balloons that are gonna be hung up over there. I'll show you in a second. They're gonna be hung up behind us on the chicken coop. We'll make sure the chickens are out of the way. We're gonna shoot some darts at balloons. It's gonna explode a balloon and out is gonna pop a nice new theme for our aquarium. Super excited. Guys, before we go any further, make sure, go down and subscribe right now. Hit that bell. Do me a favor, Billings fam. We need some love. I want this video to get 200 likes. That should be easy. That should be an easy task for Billings fam out there. So we're shooting for 200 likes. If we get 200 likes, next video, we're gonna do something even crazier. So there's gonna be about five balloons filled up and we got our, where's the paper? We got some paper. We'll write some themes down. I think we got five different themes. I think it's like skulls. Uh, I forget what the other ones are. I think SpongeBob was on there. We got some other cool ones. So I'll tell you what they are. We're gonna put them in the balloons. We're gonna mix them up so we don't know. And Grace in here, Gray, are you ready? Do you feel accurate? Yeah. Yeah, so Gray is gonna shoot at them and we're gonna pop one. So let's get to work. All right, Billings fam, so we got our balloons. Inside the balloons, we gotta put our paper with our five themes. Gray, you ready? Yeah. So we are gonna do, let's do skulls. Gray, you wanna do pirate? Yeah. Pirate, we can do sponge bob for another one. And then we need two more, how about dragon? And then we need one more, Grayson. Skulls, pirate, SpongeBob, dragon. We had an idea. What was the other one? Oh, great. Ready? Lego. Yeah. Sweet. Guys, while I'm doing this, comment down below. If we do hit our 200 likes, we're going to do another one of these. I need some ideas for other themes and other really cool ideas of how we can do our theme reveal, like the blowgun into the balloons. So, we're going to get our balloons blowed up. Blowed up. Blowed up. Blown up. Get the balloons blown up. Our themes put in there and taped up there. Do not try this at home, guys. I will be watching Grayson the entire time. Georgie, what's up? You gonna help? We gotta blow up some balloons. Yeah, George. you want a balloon? Everyone gets a balloon. There you go. All right, great. Ready? Take this paper. You gotta rip these things out here. Great, you're gonna hold these. Hold each one for me. I'm gonna rip them out here. There, Gray. I like when we are finished with all five, we are gonna jumble them up. We will have no idea which one he's gonna shoot for. <laughs> you gotta, gonna put your dart in, okay? You're gonna stand right back here. We're gonna try and pop it. All right, all right, Billings fam. Maybe we should move the baby. Ready? We're gonna aim it up there, and <laughs> come on, blow, not actually spit. Oh, oh I hit it. It bounced off. I don't know if you can do it strong enough. Try one more. One more. Oh! Just like that. We're gonna do one more. You're gonna hit it this time. Ready? Go. Grayson did a great job. He just couldn't blow it hard enough. So come here. I'll hold you and daddy will blow it. Ready, house billings? Let's go. We're gonna reveal. Which one, Gray? Which one? Let's see what it is, Gray. Let's see. It fell inside. I don't know if I can reach my fingers. I might have to go around. Ah, I got it. It's Ready, Gray? Ready? What do you think it is, Gray? <gasps> it's Whoa. Dragon! Dragon, guys. Dragon house buildings. We gotta go to the store. Yeah. Let's go. It's hot. <laughs> All right, Billings fam. We are here. You can see we're at PetSmart in the background. Fortunately, this is one of the only places where we can't bring the camera inside. I'm gonna tell you right now, I feel like it's because they're worried you might catch them mistreating an animal or something, but that's a whole other story for another day. So we can't record in there. I'm gonna try and sneak some footage anyways, but we can't really talk or anything. So let me just fill you in quickly what we're doing. We have a 10 gallon tank at home. I just gotta clean it out. It hasn't been used in a little while, so just gotta clean it out. 
we have pretty much everything set there that we need. We got a really good filter. I'm gonna take a sponge from a, an established tank and put it in there so we're good to go. Uh, and in here, we're just gonna get some dragon things. So we're thinking maybe like a volcano, probably red rocks kind of look like lava. See if they have maybe a dragon set up uh, and a couple of other things. So I'm gonna run in right now and do that. And then after, we're gonna find some fish that will kind of go with a the dragon theme. I'm excited for that. We found a couple of new stores we're gonna check out and see what they have. I wanna get some cool ones. In the meantime, guys, drop some comments down below. Let me know what you think. Again, remember, we need some ideas for new themes for another one of these. 200 likes, guys, don't forget. 200 likes, we need it done. Obviously, we want more. We want it to take off, but at least 200. Billings fam, let's go inside. Let's get this done. We are back from PetSmart. We got our bag of goodies for our dragon theme tank. Look at our awesome tank behind there. I love this tank, it's my favorite one. Uh, quick funny story, anyone else's, so we're in Connecticut, does anyone else's state do the bag tax? We get charged 10 cents now for every bag, just started the other day, it's cool. Good way to clean up the environment. Anyways, gotta get everything cleaned off. Boom. All right guys, so we are outside. We got our tank cleaned out. Just so you know, I know I think I mentioned 10 gallons earlier. It's actually just a five that we have, but it'll be perfect for this. We are gonna clean out the rocks, clean everything up and get it all in there. And a cool little thing that we're gonna do from our big, huge pond, we're gonna take the water from there to fill that for the most part. Uh, so it's gonna have a lot of established bacteria in there already. So let's get this cleaned. I got my trusty fork. We're gonna take our bag of rocks put some holes in this that should be enough so cool little trick guys so you don't have to dump it and use a strainer you just poke some holes in it and it runs the water right through it you take out any of the coloring and everything else hey and you get to water the grass at the same time <laughs> is that enough <laughs> hey, to all my uh, 90s people out there, does anyone look at Aquarium Gravel and think of Nerds, the candy? I know it does for me. It's a really cool red looking color. I don't think I've ever used red in an aquarium. It looks pretty beautiful. Gray, what do you think of the rocks? Isn't that cool? Yeah. Does that remind you of dragons? Yeah. It's like lava. Yeah. Boom. All right. Rocks, done. Gotta clean off our dragon, our volcano. We got these guys. I figured these might look like bones if they're mixed in. And clean these guys. And clean those, and it looks like you too, because you are filthy. <laughs> It's a cool dragon, huh? Yeah. As always, Billings fan, make sure, wash everything off before you throw it in there. Just get everything that's on there off. Give it a good cleaning. We don't know exactly where these are going yet. We're just gonna put them in there for now. What do you guys think? Maybe just take a few of these and we'll put it in a pile like that and it'll look like a pile of bones. Whoa. I think that'll be good for a uh, dragon theme. These, for some reason, have a ton of dust on them, so make sure to get those pretty good. But uh, I don't know exactly where, but just somewhere in there, kind of like a pile, and it will be like the dragon killed his victim. Is that a little too harsh? It's <laughs> <laughs> all right. That was kind of... Uh... <laughs> what are they fighting? What do you guys think? This is just kind of the... A rough draft, but I think it looks really good. I don't know if you guys just caught that, but uh, Thor and Loki were uh, kind of fighting in there. It was pretty crazy. So, like I said, what we're gonna do is use some of our crystal clear pond water here for in this. I don't know if I can fill it fully and bring it inside, but I'll fill it up as much as I can. Um, as you guys can see, I know we've talked about it before. There's a ton of algae buildup in here. Not a big deal. It doesn't hurt the fish. Actually, most of the fish like it, uh, but the water, because of our UV filter, comes out pretty crystal clear. So, I'm gonna have to try and this. What do you think, Gray? Yeah. It's coming out like a waterfall. I know. That'll be crazy. So it'll probably kick some stuff up. That's okay. When we get inside, we can fix it up. It is getting heavy very quick. Alright. 
That is probably as much as we're getting. But if you guys take a look, it is literally crystal clear water. So the UV filter is doing great. This is gonna look awesome. All right, let's head inside. Let's not step on babies or pots or plants, whatever it was, and set this bad boy up. That is looking awesome, guys. Like I said, that water is crystal clear and a really nice warm 84. So we'll put some more water in there, bring that temperature down just a little bit. That's a little warm, but this thing is awesome, man. This is looking really, really nice. I can't wait to see the final touches and the uh, the dragon's gonna have an air stone. So the bubbles will be coming out of that. Really cool. Like I said, we're gonna put the sponge filter in there. We're gonna take one of the sponges from in here since it already has some established bacteria on it. Gonna be really cool. Let's get this finished up. I'm so excited, that is looking super sharp. We're gonna get a backdrop in the back there so that you don't see the pumps and wires and stuff. But that is, I'm pretty impressed for our dragon theme. I know we want a couple of auto cats in there because they don't really take up any space. And then we're probably just gonna, since it's such a small tank, just do two, maybe three very, very small fish. High thin black tetra. Those sort of look dragon-esque. All right, George, what do you think? We need something that reminds us of dragons. I like these guys. Those are pretty cool. Those are cherry barbs. What do you think? Billings fam, I think we found our dragon-esque fish. It is called, I don't know if you can even read it. It's a blood fin tetra. Really cool. I don't know, I just think the blood fins kind of remind me of dragons. We are home, Billings fam. We got our new dragon-esque fish. We went with the blood fin tetra. They're gonna look really cool. We also got a couple of Siamese algae eaters in there. I wanted auto cats. So another quick side story. Probably won't be going back to this place. Super clean, I liked it. Great setup, but uh, not the fish that we want. They don't carry auto cats like we like. They don't carry some of the other fish that we like. So we probably won't go there again. Um, also, they ran out of actual fish bags. So we had to use plastic bags, which is just ridiculous. So fish are in there acclimating right now. We're gonna put them in and then we'll show you the final product. Super excited. Don't forget, we got our good vibe shout out coming. And if you wanna be in those in the future, make sure, comment down below guys, any positive stuff. We love it. Three of them all jumped in at once. Swim out. Woo! How their blood fins look and there is the final product of the dragon theme aquarium billings fam super excited looks awesome we got our blood fin tetras over there the red fins are awesome they look amazing on the red rocks it's a little difficult to see but you can see them i think they'll be really cool and then we also have two of the siamese algae eaters here which will just help keep this thing clean so overall guys i am super excited love the theme tank we gotta do more of these need some ideas make sure you comment down below so this week's good vibe shout out actually goes to a new sub warren davies Bro, love the filter, just subbed, think you need a silver arowana, alligator gar, tiger shovel nose catfish, peacock bass, and maybe jaguar and Oscar cichlids. LOL, keep up the awesome vids. Warren, thank you, man, appreciate it. Love the love and support. Love that you subbed, hope you enjoy it. Great, are you ready to help send this off? Yeah. Remember guys, make sure you sub, make sure you comment, like, share the videos around, help us grow, billings to a million. As always, what do we say, billings fam? Peace. Peace!